I can't believe Remy is gone. She... She died like she would have wanted. She died a warrior. Doesn't matter how she died. She's still dead. Dead in his mysterious ways. If you'd just chosen a successor, we wouldn't be here. Remy would still be alive. Dan wouldn't be in hell. Father didn't give us the answers, Lucy, because he wanted us to find our own way. Oh, even if it means dying? Yes. Yes, Lucy. You have to risk falling if you want to fly. Dad had faith in us. That's why he gave us choice. Well, he shouldn't have. I had the choice to save everything and everyone I care about, but I didn't. I chose wrong. Michael is going to be God because I didn't have the balls to kill a two-bit fence who wound up dying anyway. And now, who knows how many other people are going to die because of my... my cowardice. It's not cowardly to save a life. It's not cowardly to fight for a single soul. We owe it to Remiel. We owe it to Dan. We are the ones still standing. We are the ones that have to fight. Uh, metaphorically for you, of course, because our siblings are invulnerable. You'd be powerless against them. She won't be powerless. Here, you can have Stabby. Thank you, Maze. I'm just not sure I know how to use this. It's okay. I figured a way around that. You're not fighting. Dan died because of me, Lucifer. I am fighting. You are not fighting. I am fighting. Fine. Fine. Well, even if we had a dozen demon blades, it's still the four of us against a literal army of angels. I think I might have an idea how we can get our own army. You don't mean for the best chance we've got. What do you think, Maze? Hey, I'm all in. Let's kill a bunch of angels. No, Masaki. Now, if we're going to do this, there will be no killing. They're our family. You want to tie another hand behind our backs? Fight a war like a bunch of wussies? It's not cowardly to save a single life. Fine, whatever. At least we'll all die together. Well, off that optimism, Dad gave us the power of choice. What say we make one last spectacularly bad one? <laughs>